Hey everybody, welcome to Medley World. Today I'm gonna give you a ship tour right here on the beautiful MSC Meraviglia. Come on in, check it out. So here we are guys, let's start off our tour right here. This is deck 19. This is the uh, adventure park. As you can see, uh, it's early this morning. Starting to clear up, we're at Ocean K, the private island docked. We stayed overnight, so I figure, hey, let's walk around the ship a little bit and do a tour. This is where you're gonna find all your water slides, water activities. Um, let me go over here, because I wanna show you the slides a little bit and give you a little bit of information, but you can see it's a lot of fun up here. So the slides, uh, just to know, I want you guys to understand, you have to be over the age of seven. I'm getting conflictions. I'm getting some of the crew members are saying you have to be seven. Others are saying eight. So for the slides anyway. And you can see here, just to give you a little bit of information about the slides, it does have that seven. Remember, this is a European cruise line, so they have different rules sometimes in the American cruise lines. But here you have it. You have... Uh, a total of three slides. These two slides here are tubes. You use tubes and then there's another one up here that comes around in the bowl. And that one you just lay down and go. And then all these awesome little water activities. This is a lot of fun here. As you can see, that water coming down. They also have a rope course. You can see it going around. For the rope course, you must have shoes and dry, baby, uh, dry clothes and you kind of walk all around this area here. So pretty cool here. So let's continue the tour, but this is a lot of fun. Uh, I'm about, this ship is beautiful, guys. You're gonna enjoy this tour. Let's keep it moving. So on um, Italian cruise lines, European cruise lines, they don't have a deck 17. So uh, kind of like in the American cruise lines, you won't see a 13. So we're on 19, I'm on 18 now, just to kind of show you around here. They have a, a bar called the Horizon Bar. Over on the other side, they do have a spa hot tub. And then as you kind of go down, that would actually be technically deck 16. So again, no 17. And they have like this nice pool on the edge, on the end here, on the aft, looking out. Isn't that awesome? So plenty of seating back here. A lot of sunshine during the day. So this is all the way aft here, deck 18 Horizon Bar with the hot tub down there deck 16 and they have these beautiful just these nice walkways all along the ship here on deck 18 and then down there on deck 16 you have the walking track that goes around really nice let's continue on here just kind of wanted to show you that guys so you can see what we're doing and I, actually on this side here which we're going to is the sports arena it's indoors here on the MSC Maravilla, which I think is awesome. Let's head inside and I'll give you a look. Guys, here on deck 18, you're gonna find the indoor sports arena. They do bat right now, they're playing basketball. They do soccer in here. And also your kids clubs area. Uh, deck 18 here. This is where you go and you kind of register inside this lab here. And then as you walk down this way, you're gonna see they have all the different ages together so you have like the ages three years old and under and over here is kind of like the juniors hi good morning so and it's really nice it's kind of lego themed and it's called do re mi kids clubs so all in this area and this one over here is the uh attic club so check this out i think this is like the teen area here really nice lounges they have parties in here all kinds of fun stuff so there you have it that's the kids club i'm going to kind of go towards midship and i'm going to show you there's another lounge up here adults only lounge actually very convenient near the kids club right let's go check that out this is called the sky lounge here it's adult only nice little lounge um really cool spot to just hang out while your kids are at the kids club they do have a bar over here on the left side and you can see there's just some people kind of hanging out in here this morning they have a little bit of entertainment there but what's really nice about this is come on over as you take a seat with me i want to show you the nice beautiful views here looking down at the pools 
Um, below us is the buffet, we'll get there, but you can see how awesome it is. And there's their private island right out there. Also kind of want to point out that each floor kind of has its own name. This is 18, it's called the Pyramids. There is another area on this, it's the, uh, the Yacht Club uh, restaurant area, but I am not a Yacht Club member, so I cannot get into that area. But that's over in the forward side of Deck 18. So it kind of splits off, which you'd have to actually go down and walk over, or you'd have to go down a level, walk across, and go back up. So the design of the ship, as you can see, you kind of miss some of these levels here, so you can't get straight across. Just to kind of explain that to you guys, so you can kind of understand how I'm doing this tour. But let's head down to, again, no 17, 16, so we can see... Um, this is really what I want to go check out here. This sports amusement complex. As here, it's Deck 16, Sportsplex. This is where you're going to find a lot of the action. I th think this is where you have your virtual arcade games. Let's take a look in here. And there's also an F1 simulator that I'm interested in checking out when we get to that. But let's see in here some games. Got some of the uh, table hockey, some other games. Continuing down this way, and isn't this ship just, it's a beautiful ship, the way that it is set up, the way that it's accessible. So here's some more of these on the side, you can play these games. And now we're getting into where that simulator is, and there it is, there is the F1 simulator right there. Let's go have a look at that. Oh, closed right now actually, but you guys can see. Uh, there's the F1 simulators there. Also have a uh, bowling over there as well. Now all this is uh, upcharge and they have like a flight simulator as well called Max Flight. So yeah, pretty cool. Also here guys, they have this sports bar not open yet and they do have crew members here to help out with any questions you have. And let's actually take a look at the gym while we're here. Uh, they call the sports complex. Look at how awesome it is in here. And I love that it's indoors, so you don't have to worry about elements. You don't have to worry about the wind. You can come in here and play. And up there, that was where that teens club was. So it kind of overlooks all the teen and kids club all up there. Also here, guys, on deck 16 is the gym. Let's go check it out. Not a huge gym, but still plenty to do and nice views overlooking the pool area there. Let's come on right up this side and take a look. So, cool. Okay, so now we're down here on deck 15 and guess where we are? You can see all the people coming. This is the Marketplace Buffet right on deck 15. That's the aft, so I just kind of want to show you as each floor has their own name. So this is the aft of the ship. You're gonna go into the buffet here. If you followed some of my other vlogs during this cruise, I show all about the buffet. So if you're interested, uh, I'll put a link in there for our whole cruise, our, our cruise vlogs that we did. And we get into a lot of detail around the ship. This is just kind of a tour to get you familiar with the ship if you're planning on coming on. This is called the Atmosphere Pool. This is kind of like the main pool area. It's starting, I mean, it's still not, it's only 10 in the morning and everybody's ready to go on this ship, so. Um, the music's playing. They also have here, they have the Atmosphere Bar Self. So it's kind of like a mini buffet if you're out at the pool and you just want to grab something. This is very convenient, which I really do like. Um, and over here, not quite yet, but they do have soft serve ice cream, complimentary, as well as the buffet is also complimentary. Um, that's included. And they have some pretty cool flavors. This is the Atmosphere. Yesterday they had like key lime pie, they had coconut, they had chocolate, vanilla, and then they have like sprinkles and different toppings you can put on. And just to kind of show you quickly, there's Jake and Roberta helping with the ship tour today. Some cold cuts. And of course, we're on a cruise. I know it's a ship tour, but Roberta, come on, you're getting a chocolate one? I can't blame you. And by the way, this is my personal recommendation. The croissants are awesome. Let me go ahead over here by the Atmosphere Pool, guys. Show you a little bit more. Guys, here you are at the Atmosphere Pool. I kind of call it the main pool a lot while I was vlogging. So this again is deck 15. To the left over here, which is the port side, is the smoking lounge. And I can tell you the smoke, you don't really smell it. 
Um, it's quite a big smoking lounge. It hasn't bothered us at all. We're non-smokers. Um, but yeah, here's the pool area. And then again, and go up one deck one, to 16. Lots of loungers. They're doing like um, some trivia right now this morning. I can't wait to show you this next area on 16 right that way. Let's head over there. And again, they have these shaded areas. And also if it's raining, you can come under here and hang out. Uh, all protected from the elements. So it's really neat. I'm gonna go show you the rest of deck 15 right now. The bamboo pool. Wait till you see this. They also have towel exchange, so when your towels get wet or you want just new ones, you can bring them there. Um, and each night, your stateroom attendant will leave you fresh uh, pool towels in your room. But this is really what I wanted to show you. This is one of my favorite parts of this ship. It's called the bamboo um, pool. But this is really what I want to show you. When I get over here, I'm going to point the camera up and you're going to see a retractable roof. So on this cruise so far, the roof was open yesterday. When we left port, it was closed. And today it's closed because it's been raining. So when you have inclement weather on the um, Maravilla, you can still swim and enjoy almost like being outdoors. My buddy over there, he's on YouTube. See him? They love it. So, and then up above, that's deck 16 right around, guys. So it kind of overlooks. I'll take you for a little walk up there so you can see how cool it is. But yeah, and they also have a bar here as well. And this is for any age. Any age can come in here. The bamboo pool. Let's take a walk up the stairs together. And I'll show you, they do have some uh, ping pong. And they have foosball. And they do have down below you'll see the two hot tubs we got friends over there on meddling world you got these nice big hot tubs over here so you got on the port side and look at roberta getting a ping pong and also on the starboard side they have a nice hot tub which kind of overlooks with beautiful views so guys there you have it the bamboo pool guys what do you think of the bamboo pool Nice, huh? I know it's a ship yeah, tour, but you still get a little meddling world on the ship tour. It's nice and warm here too. Guys, we're hoping that you go back. If this, if you just looked up for the ship tour, go back and check our vlogs. Yeah. We've documented all the days that we've been on the yeah. cruise, three nights. And this is day three, so we still have a lot of fun left to do today. Yes. Let's continue the tour. So here, you guys, also you'll find the Yacht Club, but you do need special access. I'm not a Yacht Club member, but this is exclusive club for Yacht members. So, guys, uh, we did bounce up. This is, again, deck 16. I showed you 15. The uh, bamboo pool was on 15, and then we went up one level. So we're on 16, technically, now. So we've done all of these floors already. This floor is called this. <laughs> it was it, Thank you, Roberta. So um, we've done from here all the way. And now I'm going to skip down and go to deck 7 because deck 14 to 18 are just cabins. So I'll see you guys on deck seven. Here we are guys, we are on deck seven. So I'm gonna show you this lounge area, the casino, and some of these really cool areas that are for eating and of course the spa as we continue our ship tour on the MSC Maravilla. Guys, here we are in the aft of the ship. You will find your casino. Actually, I'll give you a little look inside as we walk through uh it's pretty small actually the casino here on this ship it's not it looks bigger than it is it's kind of all mirrored over there so and then what i think is cool is this big round bar in the middle with the sport uh well yeah a lot of sports on the tv but a lot of tvs they do have some table games here uh with a couple more slots so there you have it and as you kind of walk over on this side several more of the slot machines and actually right behind me as you guys can see that was where the casino was so we're at the aft deck seven they also have the carousel this is another uh, i can't go in right now to show up but it's another kind of theater area where they do more shows so that's called the carousel continuing on deck seven again just the beauty of this ship over here on the right side here and the left side little lounge they call this the champagne bar so anyway here it is 
and nice beautiful views as you look down into the atrium area with the nice uh, again the crystal staircase i always sure Sherwowski, i think is how you pronounce it but those are all their crystals so let's kind of just continue with this walk here guys so i can show you just the elegance of this beautiful ship so this is just kind of a place you can kind of hang out relax and as we walk through here more areas overlooking down onto deck six which is below us this is the butcher's cut restaurant this is a um upcharge so it's one of their specialty steak restaurants but just to kind of show you i like the way they have kind of all the restaurants in this area what we'll do is we'll walk down this side and then i'll loop and loop around and come down the other side for you so that's the butcher's cut and just to kind of show you each floor they kind of name each floor so this is the taj mahal floor seven now we're entering we just passed the butcher's cut we're on the starboard side this is where they do like karaoke and stuff they actually called tv studio and bar so they do karaoke i think they do some other activities during the day in here very again very nice beautiful way here forward you're gonna find the spa so this is where the spa is can't get in right now it is closed um but you'll find the spa on deck seven forward so now i'm gonna come down to port side over here but just kind of wanted to give you a view here this is deck six and then that interactive awesome ceiling up here gorgeous isn't it this changes throughout the day in different parties that they do guys over on the port side you'll find the brass anchor pub here awesomely themed uh get your beers get your drinks right here brass anchor pub let's continue down just give you a little bit of a look on the inside the door was open it's very early it's about 7 20 in the morning um and it's raining out so that's why i'm uh inside yeah, i'm doing this tour guys actually just for a second to take a break from the door i'm doing it in two parts this is kind of the second part but i'm filming it first because i wanted to start outside but it's pouring rain so i'm going to film the second part of this tour which i'm doing now but i'm going to start on uh when you're watching a video you're already halfway through the video because i actually am going to go start on uh outside pool deck it will be the beginning of the video which you already saw just to confuse you a little bit more and here we go guys we're going to head down this way uh, actually, I want to show you this little bridge here first. Again, looking through, really beautiful. Kind of give you a spin around as you can look down that way. We'll drop down to the sixth deck next. Here's another one of the specialty restaurants right here, guys. And again, it's just kind of like it's this is an Italian cruise line that they have it set up kind of like you're just hanging out, right? You're out kind of like walking down on the street. Here's the name of it. Looks like Cato, maybe. And they do actually, though, if you continue on a little bit more, you can kind of go inside. They have like some hibachi type cooking areas in there, as you can see. Little reflection, but you get the idea. So, very nice. And again, nice theming. This ship is just a beautiful ship. And now we're kind of back again with, I think they call the champagne bar. Uh, that's kind of where I started walking and we did a whole loop so let's head down actually I want to show you this nice staircase as we go down look how beautiful it is sparkling head down to deck six and let's go check it out so here we are on deck six and this is one of the sit-down restaurants let's head over and take a look um, in fact this is the one that we've been eating in and now that this is released if you haven't you can go back and check our uh vlogs our daily vlogs of the cruise this is the one we've been eating at each night six o'clock very very nice uh easy no waiting right in so far this is day three so technically i haven't gone through day three yet as i'm filming this but you can see the beauty again this ship one thing I got to say about this ship is it is a beautiful, beautiful, luxurious ship. Sometimes you kind of feel like you're in a maze. Uh, it's hard to kind of navigate at times. So I'm starting to get used to it. This is the final day. It's just a three night. 
Uh, but it did take me a couple days in. Here's another one of the restaurants back here, you guys. So this is where you'll find your main dining room. And this one's called the Panorama back here. And these are all the included sit down dining options uh, that you would get with your cruise fare. And actually I should kind of specify that they assign you to one of these um, as you kind of pick your times they'll assign you to your dining room so i'm going to continue on deck six just kind of want to show you kind of logistically i love using that word on medding world where we're at those were the specialty restaurants but again some more of the art here and you can see back down into the atrium so let's just kind of take a walk through i think they call this this is like the edge cocktail bar again in this area this is where they have a lot of the shops this is where a lot of action is at night here on deck six if you're just kind of hanging out jewelry i'm going to just walk through this entire floor with you guys as we go and then again this awesome ceiling so you can kind of see that this is a lot of like shops and there are a couple like specialty uh, options that you can purchase food let's keep moving on it as in this area each night they kind of have specials the cruise ship specials event of the day they call it it's the plaza maravilla and they do have regular shops as well you'll see here the watches and the sunglasses and as we go around also some perfumes here and it's kind of like a little circle almost a little atrium area they do have some electronics in here some headphones and some like you know necessary type items there too and some candies so let's keep going here you'll see the crepes right and you get your crepes and they have gelato here this is an upcharge ocean k this is one of their specialty restaurants kind of catering to seafood so that's where that is upcharge for this continuing on though is uh actually kind of want to show you this this is how you kind of pay for items here which i find great i think this is just awesome you can just come up your touch screen gives you all the instructions you can use cash you can use debit or credit card and you can kind of pay as you go on this cruise line which i think is just awesome uh and up here chocolate so i'm hope i'm saying this right gene felipe philip philip i'm gonna show you anyway so you'll see the name if you're interested in a little bit more detail about this chocolate factory, uh, I think it's day two. Uh, I did a kind of a tour in there, but it's really cool, really nice. Specialty chocolates. And over here actually too is a, let's go check this out. This is a tacos, hola. Uh, it's an upcharge again, um, but they have like tacos and nachos, things like that. Here's a quick look at that uh, menu really cool let's continue guys let's continue on jewelry kind of wanted to show you guys kind of a rainy dreary day here on uh ocean key we stayed overnight so it was pretty neat we're here until noon today so you actually can get off the ship and hang out but a little rainy so i'm still here on deck six just kind of wanted to show you this perspective from this lounge here this is a happening pumping lounge at night they have bands out here big dance floor kind of open for all ages i've seen kids teenagers so a lot of fun here so we're all the way in the forward here on deck six broadway theater let me see it looks open let's go in i can show you uh, i think on night one and then uh, i did show a little bit of this theater and i think actually tonight I haven't gotten there yet but i'm going to another show in here and it's very comfortable one thing i will tell you about this theater though no food or drink which is kind of odd this theater that if you're trying to walk in with a beverage they have you throw it away and there's no food at all allowed so but it's a nice cozy smaller theater so there you have it that completes deck six let's go on down to deck five so guys here we are on deck five now i'm at the forward of the ship and i kind of did this on purpose for you because this is where the ship kind of gets confusing at times so if you come down on deck five there's in the forward you you can't you can't go anywhere look so you're kind of blocked off so if you are trying to get to the um public areas on deck five you have to use the aft elevators because back here's all 
guest rooms. Now, I suppose you could go through and walk all the way down the guest room hallway, which you could. Actually, our room is on deck five, but I just kind of wanted to point that out for you. If you're trying to get down to where that atrium is, I'll show you in a minute. Use the um, aft uh, staircase or um, elevators, because deck five, again, <laughs> kind of a dead end as you come down from where that theater was. So I'm gonna head to the other side and show you deck five. So guys, here we are on deck five. I'm on the port side because I wanted to show you something really cool, which is great for us because we are here on deck five. Our room is down this hallway, but they have, this is the panoramic elevator and it goes from five right up to 15. And 15 is where the buffet is and the atmosphere pool and things like that. So that is really cool because we can just come out of our room and right up. So uh, a little bit noisy though, I'm not gonna lie, a little bit noisy though. Hey guys, got your guest service here, help you take care of everything. If you don't wanna use that uh, cruise card machine, they can manually do it. Or if you wanna do cash, you can go there. And it's just kind of an atrium area. You can do your excursions over here if you're going on an excursion. Just to kind of show you how beautiful it is again. That's what this ship to me is about. It's just about the luxury and the, the beauty of the ship. Look how gorgeous. And there's the piano bar there. Over here on the left, guys, Infinity Bar. Um, so yeah, cocktails, drinks right here. And this is kind of an area where people just kind of hang out. You know, they kind of chill before dinner. So let's go up. Let me show you the other uh, main dining area. Again, okay, guys, this is another one of the uh, sit-down restaurants, I should say, that is included. It's called Waves. Right now, they're doing breakfast from 7.30 to 9, which I'm going to go to breakfast soon. So that's the other sit-down restaurant right here. Guys, that's where our tour ends because if you go down to Deck 4, that's just kind of the medical area, almost kind of like a back of the house where the employees are and kind of where you come off to go to the island. Nothing really to see there. And then below that is all for... Uh, crew members so guys thank you so much for watching the ship tour i hope you enjoyed it this is my first time on the msc maravilla i gave you the best tour i could do and i always try to be a professional here on meddling world when i do these ship tours for you with a little bit of extra information as i go around please take a moment hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet and last but not least see ya